Hello everyone! Today we will be gagging and gooping the looks of Drag Race Down Under Season 2, Episode 2. The category is Fly Girls. Let's see what insects the queens are and let's go! First up is Molly Poppins. I really do enjoy a neon moment and this is no exception. There's structure, there's color, and there's a mix of fabrics and shapes that makes this insect outfit really shine. The makeup, headpiece, and wig are spectacular and it's a gag. Next up is Queen Kong. She was smart to choose a moth because I think most people would think of a butterfly first. I really am in love with this. I mean, the pattern on the abdomen cuts her figure perfectly while also giving moth chic realness. And the wings on the hips instead of the arms is also a touch I wouldn't have thought of that's so beautiful. It's a gag. Next up is Aubrey Have. This is pretty amazing. The patterning of the bodice to accentuate her body is perfect and the mixture of brown tones is really chic. It took her a while to get the wings out, but I don't care. She looks fabulous, and it's a gag for me. Next up is Mini Cooper. And here's the butterfly I was talking about. No, but this is really beautiful to look at, and I like the addition of the fur on the collar. It adds a level of sophistication, and the silhouette brings that out even more. She looks gorgeous, and it's a gag. Next up is Beverly Kills. I don't know what insect this is, but it looks so realistic, so cool, and I just want to be her. The makeup is very dynamic and pulls me into her insect look even further. She looks like an insect villain and I love everything about this. The shape, the color, it's all fantastic and it's a gag. Next up is Pamara 5th. I think this is simple but effective. The outfit fits her body like a glove and the reflective teal pieces gives the bodice even more structure. The wings being translucent was the cherry on top and she looks so stunning. It's a gag. Next up is Spanky Jackson. I think if your outfit is going to be all black, you need to have wilder shapes. It's almost as if this is a tad too pared down. I love the hip pieces since it gives more structure. It's a soft gag. Next up is Hanaconda. I swear the queens that chose to be moths really shine. This is so beautiful and sophisticated. This looks so luxurious, so chic, and just so stunning to see. The mix of luxurious fabric to all the beautiful shiny tones to the gorgeous makeup and accessories, so well done. It's a gag. Next up is Yuri Guy. This queen completely slayed. I cannot get over the shape of the wig being the praying mantis head. True craftsmanship and these beautiful neon colors. The neon green and pink are so vivid and the praying mantis arms and reflective corset go so well with the outfit. The makeup is out of this world and it's a gag. So that is it for today's runway video. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more drag content. Queen Kong won the lip sync against Aubrey Have. Thank y'all for watching and I am so sorry for the late uploads. I was dealing with COVID but I am back. I will see y'all next time. Bye everyone!